And the decision lies with us. I mean, it sounds awfully kind of banal, actually, but the reason that um, so many people come out on a kind of cold uh, January uh, uh, evening is because we're really concerned, because we have that, that love of the NHS, because we're really concerned about democracy, <coughs> because we've got these concerns about trade, about workers' rights, and, and genuine concerns across everybody on this panel. And I think that's much stronger than any, what they might say about who gets overall, who, or what happened. I listened to a, uh, a debate at the London School of Economics as part of kind of research for this, and it had a very august panel. It had uh, some of the World Trade Organization, there was uh, the uh, ambassador from, uh, from France, uh, and there was uh, an economics professor, and the person chairing said, we've got all scores of opinion at this meeting. Uh, uh, he hasn't. We really weren't there. This is a, you know, something that occurs kind of, uh, kind of in quiet. And actually, I think part of that debate was their, their concern about the strength of feeling and the questions that were being asked that there were people being held to account. And Duncan's quite right to be here because he wants to understand what you've got to say and kind of take it on. Oh, there's a genuine wish to understand. I would reject the idea to hand over something. I think we hold it ourselves. We've previously um, uh, managed to overthrow uh, acts in previous uh, trade agreements, which we've managed to uh, uh, roll back. There was uh, uh, one previously with uh, America, which was going to do some horrific stuff around privacy and data. You know, Gorgon-like, you cut one head off and it keeps coming back. But our vigilance means that we get to keep asking those questions. So I agree, there is an issue about uh, sort of debates about um, our control, but fundamentally I think the strength of feeling just within this room replicated across town and town across city suggests that the power still lies with us and we're hold to account and, and asking questions and those who may represent us know the strength of that feeling and we have struck down previous efforts and we can do that again and I don't want to absolve the responsibility to someone else or in Brussels. I think you know we can take that on ourselves.